Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rat here from Ratko Tarot and this is going to be Virgo Sun, Virgo Moon and Virgo Rising weekly tarot reading for July 30th to August 5th 2018. So four cards spread for you Virgo and the first one which represents the topic of your week we do have the Eight of Cups. Then uh, the second card representing the core of the situation this is going to be the Six of Pentacles. Afterwards, we do have the challenges that you need to overcome here. This is going to be the Moon card. And the last one, it is the uh, Guidance from Tarot, which is the Knight of Cups. So, Eight of Cups, it is what we do have as the core of the situation. And Eight of Cups, many people doesn't find it as a very appealing card. You know, it's kind of like a person walking away from empty cups, etc., etc. Facing mountains, walking under the moon. It's all, uh, it's all side, uh, signs of predicaments. It, it, these are signs of vagueness. But... What people, most of the people kind of like eludes them is that this person already walks away from these empty cups, all right? That person already learned its lesson and realized that there is no easy way around it, all right? You, you aim for a certain happiness either regarding your career or either regarding your relationship. And uh, finally, you have reached the stage where there is no way and there is no easy way around it. I mean, you have to basically get back into the... Um, established already way and um, do what it's necessary or what in general the life wants from you in order to accomplish a certain goal. The, the Eight of Cups is one of the cards where we receive a, a huge insight that regardless of the despondency of the situation we are finding ourselves in, you know, and this, despite how poignant we may feel, uh, it's still yet what we have to look forward to, all right? And there is still better things that looks for us into the future. And with, in that sense, this topic here says that it is likely that you, Virgo, are to let go of for certain things you are finding that they only makes you miserable in this life and it is time to kind of like um, empty your heart from them and feel that empty spot with something which will really uh, enthusiasm uh, which will something really lift your enthusiasm and it's gonna make you much more happier and then we do have the core of the situation here six of pentacles representing the realization that certain predicaments needs to be resolved all right because the six of pentacles is about resolving issues but also mm, that card because you know that the beggars the beggars issue right now is resolved by the uh the rich man giving them coins for a lunch or for whatever they need but that's not the only thing with the six of pentacles guys the six of pentacles it is about finding balance should i say but it is not the grand scheme of things of ba uh, of balance it is more about balancing balancing your actions not to be prone only to the positive side of the thing so for example if you want to do something there is always a dirty work in it and you have to be ready to do that dirty work all right and the time has come to do the dirty work this particular week and until you don't do it then uh, probably uh things are not going to turn out your way and um, because you are avoiding to do that dirty work either this is going to be a serious conversation with your boyfriend or a girlfriend or with your boss or a certain actions that you need to take against your friends or a family or in your career or in your relationship they has to be done and because we do have the moon card into a challenging position it means that this is gonna hunt you until you don't do it and the more you delay it the more harder it becomes to push it through so i suggest you here virgo to put yourself together guys and realize that again there is no way around it i mean that it's just or at least easy way around it and better face whatever you have to do in order to lift it off your chest okay and from there to start working towards your certain dreams because uh, we do have here the uh, knight of cups as a uh, guidance that the tarot card gives you or go and this card tells you only one thing remember your goal guys because as soon as you remember the full extent of your goal, either this is going to be happy, family, you know, successful job, etc., etc., you're going to realize that 
that you are going to put yourself in a little bit uncomfortable situation here dealing with a little bit with the dirt around it it is nothing compared to the benefits that you will have once you have your happy family happy relationship a beneficial job you know or a, a very loyal friendship circle so I suggest you to be true to yourself because this reading is all about that. Be true to yourself. Realize that there are things in your life you need to let go of, even if it is hard to you. And there are things in your life that you need to confront. And that confrontation needs to happen this week. Not to mention that you will find as well support from some people here that will stand behind your back and will make sure that you will never fall. So that being said, Virgo, this was your weekly tarot reading for July 30th to August 5th, 2018. I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it. And in case you're interested in a private reading with me, everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video. Rat signing out now. See you next time. Bye.